Hello guys, this is GoldenBlade19 here bringing you a Floppy Bird tips and tricks. Well, as how you guys can see, uh, Floppy Bird suddenly grabbed the top spot on the iOS and Android market. The viral phone phenomenal future uh, simply grasps the control and insanely difficult gameplay, which probably explains the appeal. Most people probably display their Flappy Bird scores on social media and majority of these numbers still sit around 15 to 40 range. Thankfully, there is big room for more improvement. It wasn't long ago when we uh, barely cracked 15 or 20. Now we have higher scores such as up to 100 and over. That said here, um, how we boosted our Flappy Bird score without using any hacks. So, I have some tips for you guys that you guys can use and that's very helpful actually. And right now I'm not doing this gameplay. Um, one of my friends is doing the gameplay and that's why he's sucking right now. But, um, just disregard that and, you know, here are my tips and tricks. So, my first tip would be to play Flappy Bird on iPad or Android tablet. Although it's possible to achieve an uh, impressive score on the smartphone, um, your thumb is very much, you know, you, you can visualize your thumb, you know, bigger on tablet or iPad and it's easier for you, it's more beneficial, you know. Uh, it's much more larger screen that gives you a chance to tap whatever you want while getting you know better view and the action so it's actually very beneficial to use bigger screen also use short and measured taps so uh, quick taps give you the chance to get into a rhythm while at the same time avoiding those dread green pipes that that kills every single one of you guys. Ideally, you should um, only tap one to two times to clear a pipe. Check those corners. Tapping too soon will definitely result in Flappy Bird. Hitting a pipe's corners, spelling, creating, doom. Um, make sure you guys tap very slow and clear the pipe completely. Pick your blinking times carefully. The issue you blink is floppy bird, um, better off you'll be. Make sure you blink plenty of times before sta uh, starting a round because blinking your eyes before is quicker and you can go through the pipes and you know when you blink while you're going through the pipes you're not gonna mess up also avoid the destruction multitask is almost impossible while playing floppy bird even taking to you know someone may result in failure and you don't want that don't look at people don't look at your TV don't have your phone on turn off your notifications um, you know if you don't want to rage on this game just you have to not to get disturbed so also take frequent breaks you know floppy bird will rack your day like seriously this game uh, you need to have a lot of patience and confidence to play this game people don't rage quit like unless unless they get killed so once you get killed you usually want to all you want to do is you just want to toss your phone away so it would, it's nice to take a break go outside do something you know just get away from your phone for a little bit your floppy bird and don't go on it till 20 or 30 minutes after don't get discouraged easier said done right um, let's say you have a higher score of 85 and then next try you die at 84 that's a huge downer but you have to shrug it off and restart except that you fail playing floppy bird more than you'll succeed but um, release the associational victory complete with your friends you know you need to compete with your friends and you know competition always is healthy sometimes a little motivation is all you need to get going and I want you guys to tell me if these tips were helpful and also comment down if 
this game ever made you so mad to the point where you wanted to smash your phone or you know just take the hammer and just beat the crap out of your phone um, well this is uh, end of this tutorial guys um, sorry for my English I mess up a lot of sayings but um, you know I'm still improving in English language I just learned to speak English so Make sure you guys show some support. I'll show you guys more gameplays of different games. I'll do more app reviews and um, I'll give you guys more tips. So I'm out for this video and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.